Hey guys, Jim here from Drink a Beer and Play a Game. I just finished up recording an episode of the Power Hour podcast, so I figured, what the hell, I got a little buzz going on right now. Let's play some alleyway on the Game Boy, the May 2021 game for Yokoi Kids. So, uh, depending on what intro I'm doing, uh, I'm playing some Alleyway on the Game Boy. It's the May 2021 Yokoi Kids game selection, so I'll be drinking the Blueberry Boyfriend by the pra it's a Prairie Artisan Ale. Uh, where does it come from? By the Krebs Brewing Company out of McAllister, Oklahoma. So I don't get a lot of Oklahoma beers in these beer boxes. And, uh, yeah, this is what it looks like. So, Blueberry Ale. I got, uh, complaints before about not, um, showing off the beer enough. So, here's that awesome beer glass I got for my wifey for my birthday. So, cheers, guys. So, alleyway, what more can you really say besides early game, breakout clone? Kind of a boring game. Not the best game in the world, but... It is a game that definitely has its place in Game Boy history, in gaming history. I thought this was one that I played a lot. Hitting start in 3, 2, 1, start. And this is obviously the later revision that has Mario as the character in the uh, spaceship, basically. So this is supposed to be a pod. I think the story is like aliens are coming and you pilot the ship. And the ship is how you fight off the bad guys. Basically. Ooh, almost lost it. I was looking at the uh, screen capture, so. Uh, yeah. Very simple control scheme. So basically, A lets you move the uh, ship around faster. B slows your movement. And from there, it is... It's Breakout. Uh, no frills to it. Every couple of levels, I think it's every three levels, you get to a bonus stage. No background music. The only music and tones you get are the music notes from hitting the hitting the blocks. So presentation-wise. So yeah, that little bit up there is really the only music that you get in the game once you get a combo going. So extremely basic uh, game here. Not a lot to say. Like I was like, do I do a review? But what the hell do you say, really, with Breakout clones? So I love me some Breakout. Don't get me wrong. Something I really love to play on the Atari. But if I'm playing it on anything other than that, I really prefer like Arkanoid or the other ones out there that add power-ups and weapons and just more strategy to it. If you really like Breakout Clone kind of games, check out Strikey Sisters on the Switch. It might be on some other consoles too, but that's just such a good uh, Breakout Clone. And there's so many other things to do besides just breaking the blocks. So there's like monster capturing, there's boss fights, there's just there's a lot of cool crap in that game. So uh, DYA Games, they make some really good stuff on a Switch. They only have like four titles on there. And I'm assuming it's on Steam and stuff like that too, but... Yeah, that's about it, and so I figured I would do a Let's Play, and this is right after I recorded Power Hour 115, so I have a couple beers in me right now, so I'm feeling, got a little buzz going. Nothing too crazy, something to help with the, uh, with the monotony of Alleyway. Uh, so doing this Let's Play like I normally do Let's Plays, where I play until I game over, I don't use a continue, and I kind of take it from there. And I gotta be honest with you right now. I'm already bored. Like, I mean, I guess it's fine. Like, even when it came out, like, reviews for it were just like, yeah, there's not a lot here. Like, it's, you know, it's like a one-for-one -one recreation of Breakout, basically. On the Game Boy. And I get it was a Game Boy launch title, but... But they still could have done a little, a little bit more. I guess... I, like, you wish. And yeah, I'm sure hitting these last two are going to be just... Um, come on. Hit. Please hit these. 
This is one I almost, like, hope I game over fast. Come on, here we go. Hit the last guy. Yeah, I'm not looking to set high scores or set any kind of records in this, because I just... Uh, it's, it's alleyway. What are you going to do? It is what it is. It isn't like last, or a couple months ago, where they did, uh... Last month was, uh, Tiny Toons? I think it was? Game I don't have, and... I try to space out these Yokoi Kids games just for the ones I don't have for my spending and my collecting. So this is cool. Like, at least every level they, uh, try to switch up the gimmick of the level. So at least in this one, it's way more easy to start the, uh, you know, the crazy combos going up top. Binga bonga 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 binga bongo bonga. So yeah, at least there's that. Almost want to just get this level done so I can take a sip of my beer. But yeah, that uh, that key lime beer that I had, and definitely check out episode one uh, fifteen. Just in general, please check it out. But you know that key lime beer that I had during that one was really, really good. Like that's one of the most surprisingly good beers I've had in a long time on this show. So that's one I definitely recommend you pick up. But yeah, key lime pie with like marshmallow and other stuff in it. This is this is gonna be the part where I don't hit anything on here now, is it? Because of this stupid gimmick. I wonder at what point when you start to get extra lives, because I'm sure you do. But I think there's what is there in this? Like, isn't there like 50 levels or <laughs> something in this? Like something ridiculous? Maybe it's only like 24. But like, can you? At least with the simple presentation, like, if you were playing this on the old OG green Game Boy, you know, it's a game you could see because of the way that screen was. But yeah, I mean, it's, uh, this is alleyway. Hit the brick, hit the block. And you know what's bad? Because, like, I'm a fan of this genre of game. And even I'm just, like, I'm struggling here with anything to talk about already. Two levels in. But I, you know, I want to get to a special stage because, you know, it shows what the special stages look like. They basically put, like, a silhouette of Mario characters. Like, that's the special stage. Why can I not say special stage right now? Get a couple beers in me and I cannot say my S's. Actually, as a kid, my S's were a problem. I was in a, I was one of those weirdo kids in speech class. Had to go to the old trailer outside of school. And it wasn't like it was, like, an integrated class. Like, it was just a straight-up trailer with a couple desks. Because good old Catholic school in the 90s. And yeah, my S's and my TH's. I would do the old uh, the old list with the fifth. Very tongue heavy with my TH's. Come on, hit it. Oh my god. And like, these shots are kind of hard enough to plan out as it... Oh, oh you mother! Why could you not just hit? There we go. Thank you. Drink the beer. Step one, drink the beer. Step two, play the game. And launch. So wait, did level three just go back to a straight... I wonder how many variations, because like if it just goes back and forth between static and moving blocks, that would be even worse. Like, man... Was this game really that, like, lazily designed? Oh, okay. Coming down from the top. I stand corrected. So that could make this a real... That could make this a real bitch later on. Now, I wonder if it's timed? Or if it's just from amount of blocks that you break. Uh-oh. Uh-oh, SpaghettiOs. It's getting lower. So, I mean, at least they have that there to be the gimmick to switch up the gameplay a little bit. And at the very least, it makes the level go by a little quicker. Oh, unless you completely whiff. Like, I'd... Ooh, uh-oh. And I can't lie, I was hoping the buzz that I had would make me mess up more quicker, so I wouldn't have to play this as much. 
this isn't one of my favorite games that they've ever selected. And again, it's not a it's not a bad game. It's an important game ish. Can you can you say Alleyway is important? Like it's a launch game, but how important really is it in the grand scheme of things? Like it's a game no one talks about. Ooh, oh, that's the first time I was like, I should have used my uh, thing to go faster. Could have saved myself there. All right, beat the level. Stage three done. And yeah, there you go. Here's the first special stage, and it's to design a Mario. So that's kind of cool. What? Does that end the special stage? Hope it doesn't take a life. Okay, just ends the special stage. So yeah, I'm definitely not paying as much attention to this as I should be, but because again. Boring game. But, a game to play. <laughs> so definitely check out that latest episode of The Power Hour. I think it was a pretty good one. Definitely had the one of the better debates we've had in a while about the most recent additions to Switch Online. And to sum it all up... I mean, this that episode will be out by the time this Let's Plays out, so... Oh, Jesus. What the hell happened with those physics? That... Doesn't seem right. But yeah, my long and short was, you know what Switch Online is at this point. And if you don't like the games on there, don't buy the service. Like, I just, like, oh, oh, my little, my thing got smaller. That's close to real life. Ha ha, ha 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 ha. Oh, made myself sad. But yeah, like at this point, like if you're only doing it for the Switch Online games, then like cancel the service because it's obviously not good. And we've talked about it before, like, it is BS that it was free before, and then, like, if you're going to do that and charge for online, do it from the start. Don't make it free for a bit and then go, oh, by the way, you know, now you have to pay us. So, these are all debates that have been had since 2018. So there's nothing new to add there that much, but, like, you know what the games are at this point that they're putting on there. Like, I just don't, I just don't see the point of being that mad about it. And I get it's not it's not a good selection of games, but it just seems like disingenuous to be like, like can you really fake being that angry at this point anymore? Maybe I'm just online too much. Well, I am online too much. Like I think I'm online too much, and I am like nothing compared to a lot of what I would consider the terminally online people, because they are out there. Oh, oh shit! I whiffed on that. That was a straight whiff. I was trying. The Boozle Hall is definitely, uh... Ooh, bye-bye. It's definitely making this not the best gameplay I could have done. But again, do you really want to when you're making a video about Alleyway? Ooh, damn it. Can I... Couldn't have just hit the two-for-one there? All right, kill it. Kill it. Kill it. Mm. I have a feeling this piece is going to be a real pain in the ass to get. Oh, oh, I like that physics. I like that physics. I like that physics. Ooh, moving. Classy. So, if I get there, I wonder what the next character is going to be. Will it be a Goomba? Will it be a Koopa? Will it be Bowser? Find out on the next episode of Drink a Bear Play a Game. Doop. Do, do, Oh my god. Stop moving so slow. Either either ball go faster or, bar, or ball kill me. I don't care either way. And, okay. That was a mistake. Drink. But yeah, for any of you watching right now, like, at this point, you basically get the gist of the game. So, it's like an unreviewable game. What do you review? Graphics, there's barely any. Sound, there's barely any. Gameplay. It's not much. Uh, control, control's fine. The control does exactly what you need it to. 
And I mean exactly. Like alleyway stick at the bottom go faster, alleyway stick at the bottom go slower. Alleyway stick in the middle go medium by not touching anything. Like what do you want? I want to dial. I want to dial with Arkanoid. That's what I want. That's what this makes me want. This makes me want Arkanoid just so much more. But it is what it is. I do love Yokoi Kids, though. Like, ever since I started, like, because I've said it before, like, I did not grow up with a Game Boy. Like, the Game Boy was just a thing that I played at my friend's house or my cousin's house. Ooh, they put the thing smaller on me. Cool. You little bitches. Maybe because the time ran out? Maybe that's, like, your time punishment at this point? But yeah, like, my parents want to buy me one, so I never... Ooh, 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 that was close. So I never got to really enjoy it. So, thanks to Yokoi Kids, I get to... That was a fuck-up. Ooh, bye, Mario. Game over. No continue? Wait a second, let's, let's hit start here and see... All right, no continue. All right, so I learned something there. I will stop the gameplay capture right now. So, yeah, alleyway. It's a game that is what it is. I mean, I didn't have good gameplay, but I don't really care either. Kind of a boring game, but it's, it's a launch title. They're all simple, so. The beer, though. Beer is pretty damn tasty. Uh, let me get that one last sip. I can't say if purely the uh, the blueberry favor comes through. It just kind of tastes like a standard sour beer, so not a bad thing. I love me some sours, so sours are definitely always welcome in my world. But yeah, so if you want a straight up sour that won't do anything too special and five point four percent alcohol, so that's you know standard. So standard beer with a standard game turned out to be a uh, fine pairing. Generic. I don't know. I'm struggling here. So yeah, alleyway. Don't go out of your way to get it, but if you find it in a bundle with some games you do want, there you go. But seriously, make sure to check out Yokoi Kids for all their submissions, and check out the links to our other videos with my other Yokoi Kids videos, our video game reviews, and we are the home of the Power Era podcast, which is also on iTunes and Spotify. Until next time, guys. Cheers. <laughs>